Hey YouTube, this is Sharp and Shiny, and this is my total haul for the month of July. Uh, but before we get into these, I wanted to talk about the release of the uh, Kennedy Gold Proof Coin. And uh, Mr. Vegeta put out a video about it. Uh, the release price is 1240 bucks, which, I mean, I just want some thoughts from the community. Uh, you know, that's almost an ounce, but you're only getting three quarters of an ounce. And I know it should be a potential numismatic or a, a, a good flipping coin, but I'm just torn a little bit. Um, I don't know if I want to drop almost 1300 on this coin or do I want to drop about 1300 on a one ounce coin uh, just a bullion piece um, I'm still undecided either way I just wanted to put that out there and get some uh, comments from you guys about it alright so moving on I have uh, at the top I have the three Hall of Fame um, uncirculated uh, coins from the US Mint I have two five ounce sunshine mint bars. I have a five ounce America the Beautiful Arches and that is the P version or uncirculated version. I have two five ounce poured bars. One is from Scottsdale, one is from Silvertown. I have a half ounce Year of the Horse gold piece. I have a about a quarter ounce uh, gold Prussia. 20 marks and I have a full roll of Washington quarters so um yeah about 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 the Kennedy coin like I said I'm just torn I don't know if I wanna uh, buy one or two of those or do I just wanna buy some full ounces uh, just some bullion pieces and I'm sure uh, the, the the flipper side of the community would probably be like well you know the Kennedy is probably the better play because in the short term, I could probably flip those and add more ounces. But the pure stacker will probably just uh, buy the, the one ounce bullion as opposed to the three quarter ounce uh, commemorative coin. So anyway, thanks for stopping by and checking out the video. And you guys have a great day.